I hope you're all doing well. Our GE volunteers just installed a super cool new exhibit in our kids' wing, and I'm about to tell you a little bit about it. So this device right here is called a theremin, and this is actually a musical instrument. It was created pretty much by accident in the early 1920s by Leon Theremin, a Russian inventor. When Leon first created this instrument, he was trying to develop a sonar device that used an electromagnetic field to recognize objects as they entered into a certain area. Instead of creating a detection device uh, for the Russian government, Theremin created a musical instrument. So using the theremin's two antennas, which are connected to the circuits that oscillate at radio frequency, the human body, which has an electric charge of its own, interferes with the electromagnetic field. One oscillator's frequency is fixed, while the other is variable. The instrument measures the difference between the fixed and the variable oscillators, and this translates into a pitch or amplitude. The theremin can measure the difference between the fixed oscillator and the variable oscillator. This is how it measures the shift in electrical charges in the human body or as you move your hands forward and backwards or up and down from the antennas. So then, this is how you use the theremin as a musical instrument. It's like playing an instrument with invisible strings, but it is definitely not as easy as it looks to play a piece of music. Thereminists, and yes, these guys are real musicians, have practiced for a long time and have serious technical abilities. So come on out to our Children's Museum at the Museum of Arts and Sciences and try our new theremin.